Hey everyone, I am James Tynan IV, writer of Detective Comics and Batman Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, I'm Mike Carlin, I'm the uh, creative director of animation at DC, and before that I was uh, an editor for 30 years uh, at DC Comics, uh, as well as being an intern in 1974. So uh, I've been around for a while, <laughs> just like a lot of these characters. <laughs> and uh, my name is Sam Humphreys. I'm the writer of Green Lanterns and Nightwing. And uh, we're the three of us are here today to talk about episode 15, titled Humanity, from season one of Young Justice. And uh, this episode is actually written by Greg Weissman, yeah. who's uh, one of the co-producers of the Young Justice series. And I believe him, he and Brandon Vietti, uh, they, they just, they love this stuff so much. We don't have to worry about their versions of our characters. This is kind of like, in my mind, it's like an Elseworld series because the characters are basically the same as what you see in the comics, but their connections are a little different and how they all fit together is, is completely original. <laughs> infiltrator. Yes. Not this infiltrators. Not infiltrators, infiltrator. infiltrator. One. That's an inviting name for a shadowy island. Also, I've had a theory that there are bloopers for him pulling out the wrong arrows, but we unfortunately <laughs> don't get to see them at this time. The just conventional arrow that kills the guard. Yes. Ah, uh, he's wall walking. We got a professional, folks. Dude, it's not even a minute in and we have an electric arrow and a grappling hook arrow. I'm Greg Weissman. Welcome to the first two episodes of Young Justice. Uh, warning up front, we will be spoiling stuff from seasons one and two, but nothing from season three. Phil Barasa, lead character designer for seasons one and two. Uh, hi, I'm Jason Spizak, and I believe I play Kid Flash in these two episodes. I'm Brandon Vietti. I'm one of the other producers on the show. Look, it's Phil Barasa. <laughs> <laughs> Barbecuing. I'm the first one to die in Young Justice. Enjoying family time. There it is. All right. There we go. <laughs> now we've got. Barasa is frozen toast. <laughs> yeah. Now we've gotten that out of the way. And that became a tradition. I think <laughs> Phil became a victim in the first episode of season two as well. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I was. Uh, the Crolatans had me uh, in a some sort of prison. Oh right. Yeah. yeah. Phil is the champagne bottle that we break over the top of every new season, basically. <laughs> it's sort of a, to echo the suffering the that you have. That's it. And, yeah. and the labor. That's right. In creating this lovely thing. What suffering? What? <laughs> it's more like hard work. Yeah. Not talking to you.